Hi guys, welcome to another video. This is Diamond Painting with Coco. Coco is my dog Chihuahua if you're new here, and my name is Rainy. Hello. I would like to welcome all of my subscribers back and thank you again for getting me over 200 subscribers. I'm so happy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And to everyone who's new, I hope you stay and enjoy the content. Today I'm going to be unboxing this Diamond Dots painting. Um, it's called Birdhouse Welcome. I'm interested to see if this is a partial or not. Um, it says the design size is 35 by 27 centimeters or 13.8 inches by 10.6 inches. And the fabric size is 43 by 35 centimeters, which is 16.9 by 13.8 inches. And it says it has 26 colors and 3,393 drills on it. So, we're gonna get this open. It's got tape on the sides and I've never been able to, here, let's, there we go. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing well today, I really do. I, I'm doing good. I'm doing good so far. No complaints here. I'm gonna rip it because I don't wanna cut myself. Well, if I do this, I can cut it. Okay. I always rip these boxes and I want to keep them intact but I've um, unboxed a few of these before and my gosh it takes forever to get these to lay flat um, the canvases are really um, stiff so let's take a look at this one I, I want to unbox this because I want to start working on it um, which is going to require me putting it under something extremely heavy the canvas is soft, but it's really, really stiff. Okay, so this is a partial. I was wondering. Oh, so wrinkled. Wrinkled, 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 wrinkled. Really, really wrinkled. Okay, and this is just instructions on how to diamond paint. Um, if you're interested in that, if you're new to diamond painting, it tells you everything. These are great if you're new to diamond painting. They're only $9.98 at Walmart if you can find them. Um, I'm sure you can also get them on Amazon. They're quick, they're easy. Um, yeah, now this one does say it's an intermediate. I don't know why. Um, maybe we'll find out when we look at the canvas. But if you're new, you'll get these instructions. So, um, yeah. Okay, and here's our drills. I'll get into the kit in a second. I really wanna look at this painting. Yeah, it's gonna need some flattening. Well, okay, so the word welcome is not, you're not going to be putting drills on that, which is, I'm glad about that, or birdhouse. And I'm glad to see that because <laughs> based on the size, I was like, there's no way that you're gonna be able to see the lettering so I'm actually I'm actually glad to see that they didn't do that so we've got our two little our two little birds here this almost looks like a barn swallow swallow and this looks like some type of wren with some very pretty flowers I really like this picture um, this is the second partial that I've ever received um, they've both been from diamond dots the other one was a sunflower picture okay I'm gonna turn this over, see how wrinkled it is. That's okay, this will all, it's fine. In fact, let's see, can I get some of this out right now? It's pretty, it's pretty wrinkled. The, um, oops, I'm sorry about that. I didn't mean to bump you. The covers to these are really stiff. They're really, or not stiff, they're thick. They're really thick. So, and see how it keeps wanting to curl even though I, I folded it back? You guys, I'm sorry. You're right by my elbow. <laughs> if you were, if we were in a diner right now eating next to each other, I'd be bumping you. Okay. That helped a little bit, not too much, but it just, I've had diamond dots underneath books, um, or underneath my, um, diamond art club canvases in the boxes for weeks now, and they are still curling. So yeah. Okay. Let's take a look at the drills and our toolkit. What do we get? I'm kind of going backwards today. I really, I really wanted to see if this was a partial or not. Okay, so here's our toolkit. 
Again, if you're new to diamond painting, this is all you need to start diamond painting. So you get a pen, okay, a single tip pen, and you get a squishy that goes on to the pen. And I am not good at doing this. So many people are good at doing this. You should watch other people's channels because they can get these on. I can't. Um, you get a little boat. Now, the only thing about this is it is a little hard to pour because it's got this instead of a, let's see, do I have another tray? I do. Instead of a pour spout like this. Can you see that on the canvas, the pour spot? So this one doesn't, but but it's, it's perfectly fine if you're starting to diamond paint. This is your wax. You're gonna peel back this little layer right here and dip your pen into it until your pen is full of wax until this part is completely full of wax. Sorry, I've got my, I had a hangnail on my finger, it hurts. And my nails are horrible. Okay, so that's our toolkit, perfect. So you're in, what, what are you out? $10 and you've got all of this to diamond paint your first painting to see if you like it. Here's our colors. Now this is gonna be a little hard to see because this is, it's blue colored, but there's some greens some hot pink, some lighter pink, real light pink, a yellow, lighter yellow, this is kind of an orangish yellow, lighter yellow, uh, a really, really light blue, dark blue, little light blue, okay. We've got, ooh, this is a pretty, I don't know what you would call that color, purple, dark green, lighter green, this looks really similar to that other color, doesn't it? Looks really similar. No, no, it's not. They're completely different. Orange, lighter orange, yellow, some blues. And this is, um, I'd be interested to know what DMC color this is. That's the other thing, and I'll talk about that in a minute. Um, really dark green, some blues. Lots of greens in this one. Oh, and we have an AB. That's a nice surprise. We have an AB. Okay, and AB stands for Aurora Borealis. It is because of the coating that they put on these drills that shine like the Aurora Borealis. And it makes your drills just sparkle and shine that much more. Um, so yeah, that's, I, I was alluding to this, but Diamond Dots does not go by DMC number. They, they have their own system. Sorry, I bumped you again. Oh my gosh. What a rude host. Diamond Dots goes by their own system. So theirs is an 8,000 system, which I do not understand at all. Oh, and it looks like this is our AB because it's in the five. Wait, we have two that are in the 5,000s. I didn't see a second AB. Maybe I'm reading that wrong. Maybe that's not what that means. Okay. I didn't see a second AB. Did you guys see one? Yes, it's right here. Okay, we've got another one, the white one, right next to the other AB. Okay, so we have two ABs, which look like they're in the 5,000s. So they go by 8,000s, so you need a di diamond dot to DMC conversion chart to figure out what the DMC number is if you're interested in saving your drills. Now, what I'm gonna have to do with these ABs is I'm gonna have to find out the conversion from diamond darts to ABs, and then from ABs to DMs. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'll probably just match them up by eye. So that is Birdhouse Welcome. All of Diamond Dot's uh, paintings are licensed, so you don't need to worry about that. They are all licensed. Uh, this one's licensed from Shutterstock.com, so you don't need to worry about any of that. Um, yeah, so go get one if you're new to diamond painting. Even if you're not new to diamond painting, this is a really cute photo. So I wanted to get to this, so I needed to uh, unbox it. So anyway, my friends, I hope you enjoyed this video. Hit that like and subscribe button, and I will talk with you later. Loves!